Boxable was once seen as the symbol of futuristic mobile housing, a promise that anyone could own a stylish, affordable home. But that chapter may be closing faster than we think. Tesla is quietly preparing something that could make the entire housing industry pause and ask, Did we just witness the biggest transformation in modern living? A home that costs only $7,995, generates its own power, demands almost no maintenance, and even includes free land opportunities in parts of the United States. Sounds impossible, right? Yet, this time, it's real, and it could be the beginning of an entirely new era in how humans live. Stay with me, because by the end of this video, you'll see exactly why the dream of living smart, sustainable, and financially free is now closer than ever before. The only question left is, is this the end of Boxable and the rise of Tesla's housing empire? Before we go deeper, give me just five seconds. If you love direct, practical breakdowns like this one, hit subscribe and help future Drive Hub. Don't forget to turn on the bell icon, because every time a new Tesla home update or free land deal drops, you'll be the first to know and never miss out on a golden opportunity. Now, let's get to the real question everyone's asking. How does free land actually work? And can it really be paired with the Tesla tiny house? The phrase free land sounds like something from a dream. But in reality, it's a carefully planned incentive by many small towns trying to attract new residents. For instance, Marquette, Kansas officially announced it would give away residential lots to families willing to build new homes in the Westridge area. All you need to do is apply directly through the city clerk. This proves one thing, free land isn't a fantasy, it's a conditional opportunity. It rewards those who come prepared with a building plan and a realistic vision. And with a modular home like the Tesla Tiny House, meeting these requirements becomes surprisingly easy. Similarly, Mankato, Kansas, often misheard as Mano, offers free Johnson Edition lots to people looking for small-town peace with modern benefits. The town has under 1,000 residents, and the entire county sits around 3,000, so every new home really matters. Bringing a handful of Tesla tiny houses could revitalize the community, increase tax revenue, and even spark local economic growth. In fact, an analysis of Kansas free land programs shows that most lots range from 11,000 to 25,000 square feet, big enough for a Tesla tiny house, a solar setup, and even a private garden. Cities usually require construction to be completed within a year, a perfect match for Tesla's modular, quick assembly structure. Let's head north to Nebraska, where the city of Curtis openly lists its free lots in Curtis program. The only condition Build a single-family home that meets city standards within the timeline. The huge advantage? Every lot is already located on paved streets with utility access, meaning you save thousands in trenching and setup costs. That's money you can instead put into better insulation, energy storage, or smart systems for your Tesla tiny house. Another example comes from Beatrice, Nebraska, through its unique MAW-to-own program. It's not a lottery. It's a structured path to ownership. Applicants must apply, sign agreements, and complete construction to earn credits toward owning the lot outright. The city's past phases required homes to be completed and occupied within two years, encouraging steady progress without pressure. Then there's Colorado's Flagler program, which focused on free land for small business projects that could create jobs. It's a great reminder that every state shapes its land incentives differently. Some target individuals, others target enterprises. But for private homeowners dreaming of a self-powered Tesla house, Kansas and Nebraska remain the most realistic choices in 2025. Of course, you may be wondering, how free are these offers really? Well, they come with two key condition groups, time and construction standards. The time frame usually requires you to start or complete construction within 6 to 24 months. The construction standards often include having a permanent foundation, meeting a minimum floor area, and following local zoning rules, like roof pitch or setback distance. And here's the good news, the Tesla tiny house already fits these expectations. It has full plumbing, anchoring options, and energy systems designed to meet residential codes. You just need to document everything correctly during your permit process. 
All of this shows that free land programs aren't random giveaways. They're strategic partnerships between small towns and forward-thinking homeowners. They bring life to quiet places while offering pioneers a rare chance to live affordably. Combine that with Tesla's $7,995 modular home concept, and you've got a real-world formula for near-zero living costs. Think about it. Free land, solar-powered home, minimal bills, low maintenance. The American dream, rebooted for the energy age. So, the real task isn't finding whether free land exists. It's choosing the right one. Compare each town's location, infrastructure, and time requirements. Then calculate what you save long-term by cutting out rent, mortgages, and energy bills. If you could pick, would you rather live on a free lot in a peaceful small town, or spend a bit more to be closer to a city? Comment free, below if utilities and freedom beat distance for your Tesla tiny house. Now that you know where the dream of free land can become real, let's look at what makes the Tesla tiny house such a practical and powerful idea, a design that's small in size but huge in potential. At the core of this house is one brilliant concept, independence. Tesla built it to survive, function, and thrive without relying on the grid. It can literally power itself. Imagine waking up every morning in a compact, modern home that doesn't depend on an external power company. No rising bills. No noisy generators. Just clean sunlight turned into smooth, silent energy. The Tesla Tiny House uses a set of solar panels and battery storage designed to power everything. Your lights, AC, induction stove, refrigerator, and every single outlet. On average, a small home for one or two people uses around 8 to 12 kilowatt hours per day. Let's break that down in real-world terms. A modern inverter refrigerator consumes roughly 1 to 1.5 kilowatt hours. LED lighting adds 0.3 to 0.4. Entertainment devices such as laptops and TVs take around 0.6. An induction stove uses 1 to 2 and a small air conditioning system of about 9,000 to 12,000 BTU consumes 3 to 6 kilowatt hours depending on your local weather. Tesla engineers designed this system so you can easily generate that much power right from your roof. A 400-watt solar panel typically produces about 1.5 to 2 kilowatt hours per day in sunny regions. That means 6 to 10 panels can cover all your daily needs, producing between 9 and 16 kilowatt hours. The Tesla tiny house roof provides about 150 square feet of usable space, enough for most of these panels. If your roof can't fit all of them, you can simply mount additional ones nearby on a rack that adjusts with the sun's angle, an easy tweak that keeps your system efficient all year round. The electricity generated flows into a 13.5 kilowatt hour Tesla Powerwall battery pack, similar to the one found in homes across the U.S. This battery can store enough energy to power your home comfortably through a cloudy day. And if you want extra security, you can add another battery later. That's the beauty of Tesla's modular design philosophy. You can start small and expand when you're ready. Tesla also took energy conservation seriously. The house is built using SIP insulated panels that trap heat efficiently. The roof and walls are thickly insulated, and the windows are double glazed to reduce thermal loss. The result? You stay cool during summer and warm during winter, while your AC or heater uses far less power. Even something as simple as better insulation saves energy, often the equivalent of removing one or two solar panels from the total system. It's small engineering decisions like these that make the Tesla tiny house so balanced and affordable. When it comes to materials, Tesla chose long-lasting and low-maintenance options. The exterior uses powder-coated metal or fiber cement boards, both of which can last decades without repainting. Inside, you'll find moisture-resistant walls and engineered wood finishes that create a warm, modern atmosphere without demanding constant care. Maintenance is refreshingly minimal. Clean the solar panels once every few months, check your roof and gutter once a season, and make sure your energy system stays dust-free. That's it! The onboard Tesla software monitors battery levels and performance automatically, the same technology logic that made Tesla cars world famous. Mobility is another part of the magic. The Tesla tiny house weighs around 6,000 to 8,000 pounds, 
light enough to tow with a capable pickup truck or certain electric vehicles. As long as the load is balanced, the hitch height is correct, and the brakes are set properly, you can move your home wherever you want, from one free land site to another. That's freedom in its purest form. You could live a few months in Kansas, spend a summer in Nebraska, or relocate closer to family, all while keeping the same familiar home that you designed and customized. Of course, nature can be unpredictable. In cloudy or winter conditions, each solar panel may only produce around 1.2 kilowatt hours per day. Tesla recommends slightly oversizing the system by about 20 to 30 percent if you live in colder states. Adding a backup battery ensures constant comfort, no matter the season. And if your lot has access to a city grid, connecting it as a secondary power source gives you unlimited reliability. So in simple math, a Tesla tiny house running 8 to 12 kilowatt hours a day stays perfectly balanced with 6 to 10 solar panels, one or two power walls, and strong insulation, a complete, standalone ecosystem. Now here's where the real comparison begins. Tesla Tiny House versus Boxable Casita. Both claim to be the future of housing, but their goals are not the same. Boxable became popular because of its foldable prefab design, which can be delivered and set up quickly. It's meant for people who want a traditional home that installs fast. But here's the catch. The Boxable Casita still requires a foundation, crane setup, and utility connections before you can move in. Once you include those, plus transportation, permits, and labor, the total cost can easily exceed $60,000, depending on your location. The Tesla Tiny House, on the other hand, is engineered for modularity and self-reliance. It skips the need for heavy machinery or complex installation. Because it's mobile, you don't need a fixed foundation unless local rules demand it. You can park it, anchor it, and power it anywhere the sun shines. That difference isn't just convenience, it's philosophy. Tesla wants your house to function like your car, ready to move, powered by itself, and free from external control. When it comes to operating costs, the comparison gets even clearer. The boxable casita works best when connected to the city grid. While it can technically have solar panels, the roof's small surface area limits capacity, and custom retrofits often cost more. The Tesla Tiny House, on the other hand, is literally built around its solar and battery system. It's born to be off-grid. Energy independence is baked into its DNA. Then comes mobility and flexibility. The boxable casita is technically movable, but once it's installed on a foundation, relocating it becomes a major operation. The Tesla Tiny House is the opposite, built to move. You can hitch it up in the morning, drive across state lines, and have it set up again by sunset. For legality and permits, both options can qualify as permanent dwellings if anchored, but the Tesla Tiny House also fits RV-type zoning, meaning you can register it as a mobile residence in many regions. That gives owners far more flexibility with land use and taxes. So which one truly owns the future? That depends on what kind of future you believe in. If you want a larger, permanent home with traditional utility hookups, Boxable still makes sense. But if you believe in energy freedom, low costs, and full mobility, the Tesla Tiny House is the clear winner. Tesla is not just making a structure, it's creating a living system that runs on sunlight, stores its own energy, and follows you wherever you go. And here's an interesting fact. Elon Musk himself once lived in a small prefab home near SpaceX's Texas site to demonstrate sustainable living. That sparked the original idea behind Tesla's housing concept. A home that's not just affordable, but intelligent. The dream is simple. A $7,995 smart home, powered by the same solar technology that fuels Tesla cars, paired with local free land opportunities across America. For the first time, you could live debt-free, bill-free, and boundary-free, in a real, physical way. Now pause for a second and imagine that. Your home generating its own power. Your land costing nothing. Your bills reduced to zero. And your freedom unlimited. If that vision inspires you, hit subscribe right now and help turn on the notification bell so you never miss updates about Tesla's $7,995 tiny house, upcoming free land deals, and cost breakdowns by climate zone. Because in the next video, we'll go even deeper 
comparing lifetime costs across hot and cold regions, showing you a simplified permit checklist, and revealing a list of U.S. towns with the easiest land application programs for your Tesla tiny house. So, what would you choose if you had to decide today? A fixed modern house that ties you down, or a self-powered home that moves with you? Comment below. Tesla tiny house. If your answer is all about cost, energy, and freedom combined. Because while Boxable still has its place, when you weigh the numbers, the independence, and the lifestyle, it's clear that the Tesla tiny house is not just another idea. It's the start of a new housing revolution, and that revolution might just begin in your driveway.